Hey guys, my name is Dave and welcome to another video. So, I know over the course of the past few days I've been kind of lacking in the whole category of generic like videos that I normally do, but things have just been kind of thrown all over the place recently. Um, not to mention I've been kind of lost in some kind of time loop, I guess, in my mind. I, I, I guess to reiterate what I mean by that is just that my brain has been kind of been going through loops of, like, replaying events that have happened to the point where it's I, I've been struggling to actually keep up with my own, like, present circumstance in a way. I, I guess that's the best way I can word it at the current moment. Um, I mean, nothing, nothing's wrong or anything. Uh, it's just more the fact that because of that, it, it's made it very complicated for me to get back to this point that we're doing right now. Uh, I just kind of wanted to touch base on this, just, you know, so you guys know a bit more thoroughly of what's going on. Now, don't get me wrong. Everything that I put up vlog-wise that's miniature uh, prior to this, all of it is still accurate, like yesterday. Um, Pink Fox and I actually did go on a date, and it was really fun. Um, it was somewhere very uh, quick, uh, I believe. I guess you could call it that. I don't know. Uh, Cafe Rio, which isn't a place I've been in in a very long time, so it was actually kind of refreshing as well. I was also reminded on why I don't like the chips there. <laughs> They're very dry, very bland. No salt, basically, so I was like, uh, yeah, no. Um, and, like, the day before, I, I, there, there, I could go through a list of different things, like the different vlogs I went through previous to this one, but none of them are, like, false in any kind of way. They're all real. Everything in it that I talked about actually was occurring. Um, it's just that simultaneously, something I didn't bring up was just that at the same time, and no recent event actually caused it, which is weird. My brain has been going through, like, these loops, um, like I said, time loops, of where it would think of certain cer events of the past, and I'd suddenly just start constantly thinking of them, and I just, I, I guess I wasn't really sure what to do about that. I mean, here we are now, and it's no big deal. I'm kind of coming to an end of this, and this has a tendency to happen every once in a while for me, which is weird. If I were to guess, it probably had something to do with the last um, vlog that was done in this more professionalism kind of way, I guess, where I was talking about like the idea that you're not alone. Um, it wasn't the very last one that I did, but ever since that one, two weeks ago, I believe, actually, today. Two weeks ago today, I put up a video. It was supposed to be like this comforting video. It, 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 an annual type. Um, I, I guess after putting that up, loops of different lonely points leading up to how it's not so much the case anymore kind of just started going through my head and I was like, jeez. I, I, I was kind of, I wouldn't say mourning or anything, reminiscing on how things were when I didn't really have anyone. Bear in mind, I've always had my family, my genetic family. Like I've always had them. They're great people. I love them to death. Um, and ever since I met Aaron and Amber, I've always had them. And likewise, all the following I just listed, I love them all to death. They're great people. Um, people that I would give my life for. And the same goes for my in-laws as well. However, outside of that factor, when you deplete all of that, you just... I, I guess... 
out outside of them and D9 and I think yeah that's really it when you all the people I just listed great people like I've said already love them to death all of them D9 Aaron my parents my in-laws my wife uh, my siblings yeah, genetic family in general if it's not under the category of people I just listed then outside of them I guess life is kind of in a way it, it's felt like an empty void in a way and sure I always seem like this energetic idiot who's just ready to go for the day and do stupid things but there's a thing about that with me and energy it's it cores from one of two things either it actually is a bunch of excess energy from the day or it could be me just feeling a little bit down and exerting as much energy into something as possible to try to contradict that negative feeling and sometimes it works but in the case of the past few days I'm honestly sure not past about a couple weeks scatteredly it's been hit and miss now I'm very happy with that I have that's not what I'm saying I'm not saying I'm unhappy with my life that's if I ever claim that bull crap um I am very happy with what I have with the people I have but that think back kind of the, the, the thinking back to circumstances where I didn't kind of impacts me in a way where it's like the memory of it on its own has a tendency to have a very negative impact to the degree where I'll go like if nothing's going on I will go freaking mute now I'm one of those people who I'm optimistic enough to where if I go dead silent you should immediately be able to tell something's wrong and you should focus like on my facial expressions if I show frustration in my eyes stay as far away from me as possible but if I show like any kind of other like sadness for example I'm most likely reminiscing and thinking back to points in my life where I had nothing. Metaphorically, it's never been the case where I actually have had nothing. But there have been points in my life where it has felt like that. And throughout those points in time, it's been very tough for me to actually create proper videos. I mean, here we are now. I'm coming to the end of it. I can, I can always, I can always tell when I'm coming to the end of those kind of sessions, and we are, um, <clears throat> or I am, and we're gonna get back on track with videos, like I said we would yesterday. Um, this video, I think, just needed to be said, just to kind of talk about like what goes on during those time periods that causes me to kind of struggle to actually make these vlogs. The gaming ones aren't as hard to do because, well, to me, they're kind of therapeutic in a way. Spending time with Amber, Aaron, and playing those games, all three of those, since these are the things I do the most often, are very therapeutic for me. The games, because of the fact that they distract me, Amber and Aaron, and when I get the chance, uh, D9 and my family, these individuals are therapeutic to me because, well, for me, I've talked about this before, but for me, having peers and people who will listen around, like who you actually know, works better for me than an actual, um, Well, a professional. Let's put it that way. Because there are different topics, different like titles. Overall, a professional won't work as well as a peer for me. And I've talked about this before, I believe. 
this aspect also is kind of the case with stuff like this. Actually, realistically, um, last night, after Amber and I got home from our date, I actually hung out with um, Aaron for a bit. Amber was too tired and she pretty much went to bed afterwards, but the vlog that I made, I actually made at the end of the hangout. Um, Aaron was finishing up with some stuff that he had to do and he was gonna head off afterwards. While he was doing that, I was planning on heading off to bed, but before doing that, I spent a few minutes to actually create a vlog talking about how good the day was. And the fact that I was able to do that, I could tell that this whole circumstance was coming to an end. And these, it's happened before where I reminisce on these bad points in my life. I don't know why it happens, but it, it just does. And they're, sparks of time it's it's not like it happens a lot but it's scattered so I don't I don't concern myself too much with it as long as I'm able to do what I like doing best and that is take care of my wife take care of the people I love more than anything else in general actually um, just because of how much they mean to me and doing these doing these different videos. It sometimes feels a bit rusty during those time periods, but it would bother me if I didn't do them. In fact, every time that I have a only vlog day because something happens with the gaming stuff, it actually bothers me. But it is what it is, and there's not much I can do about it. However, I'm happy to be out of it because now we can get back into the process of trying to figure out um, what topics we're going to do. I just figured I might as well talk about kind of what happens during these time periods. That way it's kind of more well known. Um, <clears throat> I do plan on trying to get Pink Fox in these videos again. I have offered a couple times and she's just been very busy. In fact, it's going to be very hard not to do so because Pink Fox, fun fact, by the time this video goes out, it's already been about a week and a half since. But as of the recording of this video, she is actually about to start at the police academy, which I am very proud of her for. Um, it's been something that she's wanted to do, the aspect of helping people specifically, actually. And this one gives her the chance to do it in reflection to what her life has been like. But that is her own personal information, which I am not going to talk about. Uh, it is not my place to talk about it. However, all you guys need to know is that her personal life has prepped her for something that will suit her better than anything else. And the fact that she has been wanting to do this, and ever since she said she has, I've been supporting it ever since. I've been pushing her to do whatever she can to try to do it. Um, at her own accord, she's gone to the gym to make sure she's fit and ready enough to meet all the criteria necessary for it. I honestly already think she was, but... You know, better safe than sorry. Um, <clears throat> not to mention all the factors that the studying. She has not gone to school since certain circumstances have led her, had led her into like this deep depression, which kind of made her bail for the time being, which this happened a couple years prior to now, I think. I don't know. It's been a few years at least. So, but ever since that, she hasn't had the chance, and now she's given the opportunity, and she's taking it. And that opportunity, I'm, I couldn't be more proud of her for. And this is... Seeing her pursue this goal, it gives me more reason to pursue the kind of goals that I have. And I guess, in a way, finally having that chance to realize hey I can finally pursue that goal some weird reason I feel like that tr that that triggered the idea of you know what I need to start doing the the kind of vlog I did where I talk about like you're not alone kind of thing um, or there's always hope like a hope filled type video a couple weeks ago I did that and because of that and some weird reason it triggered the chain of events that is finally coming to event to to an end now. So is this Amber's fault? Of course not. It just 
trigger good in me that eventually made me think of all the bad for some stupid reason. Uh, this has been me for a very long time, though. And hey, like I said, we can finally get back to the flow of things like we used to be. Um, I got a couple of different playlists that I can keep continuing on, which I plan on it. There are several that we can work on. So hey, when do we get back to it? But in the meantime, I'm going to leave this here. Um, I actually got to send out the second video for today. Originally, I'm not going to lie. The video to, for today was actually going to end up being me saying that I was super exhausted. In fact, technically, I already scheduled that for upload, so I need to take that down and replace it with this one. Um, this one's way much. I, I'm a little bit more awake. I ended up taking about an hour and a half long nap, and I was like, you know what? That's not going to suffice. I'm removing it and replacing it with this since we are actually set to go with these kind of vlogs. The only time we should be doing vlogs like coming from the phone otherwise should be like either random BS videos um, or if we get back to it at some point it'd be hard to do now because of the school thing that I mentioned for Amber but the drive with Dave and Amber things. Um, so we'll see. We'll see what happens. In the meantime though, yeah, I'm gonna leave this here. Thanks for tuning into the video guys and Normally I do like different video thingies, but this doesn't really fall under a specific category, so check out the channel if you have not yet. Um, we got a lot on there, so a lot of variety to look for. But in the meantime, I'm going to head off. Thanks again for tuning in, guys, and I will see all of you later. Bye!